Hello Summit Push Cruisers. This week we celebrate our one year anniversary of vlogging cruises. And in this episode, we're gonna share with you one of our travel stories that had many nail-biting moments and setbacks. And unless you're one of our viewers that has been watching for a long time, you've probably never heard this story. The video is no longer out there, so we hope you enjoy. Trips that go wrong. Here is our Cuba travel story. We got the opportunity to go to Cuba. It was very low cost and it was a short cruise, but it docked overnight in Havana. So we thought, here's our chance. We're going to take it, so we booked it. So here we go, and it's only a matter of days. We're going to be in Havana. There's going to be the old-fashioned cars. There's going to be the culture. And for me personally, I was looking forward to connecting with many of the Christians that are there in Havana. But we had a very tight timeline, and that's when things began to take a turn. Here's our story. We have got the opportunity to take a cruise to a country we have always wanted to go to, Cuba. But here's the deal, there is a major time crunch. So Kelly and I are about to hop in the van right now. We are going to run down to Port Canaveral, Florida. It's a long drive. We are gonna be sleeping in the van. It is like a major time crunch, but we hope we can make it. We yeah. think we can, but we want you guys to come with us. This is going to be an adventure. Let's go. Sure will. First, there was the credit card issues. Okay, so we are literally just seven miles down the road. We haven't made it far. We're at our first stop. It's gonna be a long night, but what did we just find out? So I was checking my email and I got a notification from my credit card about a fraudulent charge. So they've shut off our credit card. So we gotta work through that. So now we are on our way to Florida for a nighttime drive where we got to crash for any rest we get is going to be in the van. Credit card being deactivated because somebody's spending loads of money somewhere <laughs> on it, not us. Um, and we're just seven miles in. It is an adventure. It Here is. we go. Hey, Here life we go. goes on. This is what keeps it exciting in life, folks. That's a pretty good sized Planet Fitness. Then there was the night sleep in the Planet Fitness parking lot. We were so slap happy. It was so bad. All right, so it is the middle of the night and we are extremely tired. <laughs> so, you cannot stop laughing. <laughs> we have been trying to get this shot for like five minutes, but we can't stop laughing because we are so slap happy. So cut, we'll try it again. So it is the middle of the night. We are extremely tired. So we have pulled over to get a little rest. So our plan is to get a few hours sleep, get up in the morning and get a quick shower and hit the road. So that's what we're doing. Now we're a little freaked out because we're like in the middle of this parking lot by ourselves, and we don't know how this works. We don't know if we're gonna have a cop tapping on the window. I don't know if somebody from Planet Fitness is gonna come out at some point and like, why is this guy and this girl laid out in the back of this van? thinking we're doing something we shouldn't be doing. Um, but anyway, we will try if something weird happens in this few hours we're resting to have the camera rolling, but it's bedtime. Yeah, good All night. Right, good night, we'll see you and talk to you in the morning. But it was so nice to be able to get a shower the next morning. All right, you all fresh and clean? Fresh and clean. All right, you look beautiful. Thank you. Okay, so we got several hours sleep last night. We got up, got our shower. We've now got our coffee, but we still have a busy day ahead of us because we have a huge time crunch in order to make it to the port on time. So if we hit any major traffic or anything like that, we could be in trouble. So we have got to get on the road. Let's go. All right, let's do it. We have made it to Florida, woo! What's wrong, Kel? <laughs> that just sounded so funny. <laughs> we are in Florida. Woo! Florida. We are in Florida. <laughs> Cut. Cut. Then there was the car trouble in Florida. Man. Okay, we just made our final stop. We ran through a drive-thru, got a quick bite to eat. We stopped and topped off with gas, 
right now we have about two hours we have to be at the port so if we have any extensive delays or anything we're not going to make it so we are about to get on the road all the way into the port no more stops Give them an update on the credit card deal where somebody had charged something. Yeah, so I called the credit card company last night. Uh, they were super awesome, took care of us, so we got our credit card up and running again. So we're good to go there. We have money and we're on time. Hey, let's go, final push. Right, go. Watch yourself okay, later. literally my heart is beating so fast. We just filmed the deal, like final push, got in the car, car would not start. It was like doing nothing. And we've had issues with our battery in this car and it was not started and kelly was like no no you're joking and i'm like i am not joking and i did it a couple times and it and it started but before that it was doing nothing so we are not okay just make out press the gas to make sure it's running we are not turning this thing off and it has and been clear <laughs> it's been clear and beautiful now it's pouring the rain so listen hey life is an adventure adventure get this is all about the unknown and the excitement of seeing what happens and for us, are we going to make it? We're about to find out. Come on. I have not seen it rain this hard in a long time. But we made it. All right, so we are here at the port. We actually made it on time. We have 14 Ooh. minutes to spare from when we were supposed to arrive. So we made it, yes, and we we're here. It. Shouldn't be any problem getting to Cuba now, right? It is not that easy. The ship was great. We were on the Norwegian sun. The first part of the cruise went fine. We spent day number one in Key West. It turns out that Key West, Florida is the place of presidents. Not only do we have the few that we just saw, but behind us we have the Harry Truman Little White House. Then we got the news. It was about 9 o'clock at night. We got back in from Key West and we got back, got us a little nap. Much needed nap. We were so tired. But then we got an announcement. They came over the intercom and said, immediate government restrictions. We are no longer allowed to go into Cuba. So I know. So we were so looking forward to that. Um, and instead, now we are going to Nassau, Bahamas. Nassau, Bahamas. Man, I tell you what, people around the ship are so upset. <laughs> yeah. And we're, I mean, I want to go. I will get to Cuba one day. I thought this was an opportunity. That's why we jumped on this. Mm -hmm. um, but one day I will get to Cuba. And, um, but anyway, we're just going to roll with it for now. You know, life throws you a curveball. Give God thanks and just keep smiling and keep moving. And that's exactly what we're going to do. Okay, so we hope you enjoyed that. And also want to let you know about a free resource we're going to have available for you very soon. We have put together a cruise planning guide that's got some super information in it. It should be out in the next week or so. So if you want to be sure to get a copy of that, make sure that you hit the subscribe button and hit that notification bell. And we'll let you know when that becomes available. And also, question of the day. What is one of your most memorable travel moments? Would love for you to comment below and share that with us. And thank you so much for watching today.